Well, in less than 10 days, the first puck will drop on Bemidji's Hockey Day Minnesota experience. Our Josh Peterson shows us the science and technology behind Hockey Day's outdoor arena. Just beyond the newly erected gates lies the epicenter of what is expected to be the largest Hockey Day Minnesota event ever. As crews begin to assemble the massive tents in the hockey village, it's a busy construction scene at the rink where crew members are preparing for what is expected to be the Super Bowl of hockey. From an outdoor uh, or hockey event, uh, this is probably the home run. I mean, this is the one that uh, probably the, uh, the biggest from uh, most exposure that you're going to get. Since New Year's Eve, crews have been working around the clock to give both spectators and hockey players alike a world-class rink. Uh, the dashboards you see here, the Pittsburgh Penguins last season in their outdoor hockey game. I've got the best team in the country that I could put together to, to run this outdoor game with me. The rink itself has already been on the national stage and experts in ice making are on hand to make sure everything runs smoothly. We want the kids and the families and the community to show up and be just say, oh, it's an ice rink and here we go. Um, the behind the scenes stuff is, um, there's a lot of work to it. There's a lot of great volunteers here. There's a lot of uh, very skilled tradesmen out here uh, working hard to, to pull everything off. Many factors play into the makeup of the ice, everything from Mother Nature to the latest technology in refrigeration. This isn't your typical backyard hockey rink. In fact, over 28 miles of tubing will run through the base of this rink to refrigerate the ice so that it's perfect for all weather conditions. We'll be keeping a, a close eye on the weather and trying to see uh, uh, what we need to do to kind of change things up if, if things go south or, or if things are going well, then we'll just keep rolling. For the overall install of the rink, weather conditions have been ideal, which has played a role in keeping everything on track. Mother Nature has been unbelievable to us, <laughs> as you know, with the, um, the abnormally warped temperatures. And now when we need it to cool down, it's going to cool down just in time for us to make ice. In Bemidji, Josh Peterson, Lakeland News. The overall price tag on Bemidji's Hockey Day experience is expected to land between three and four hundred thousand dollars, which has all been paid through sponsorships, tickets, and merchandise sales. The puck drops on the thirteenth annual Hockey Day Minnesota next Thursday. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.